Hello everybody, this is Louis from Dope Prop and today we are at East Point Green Condominium. Uh, we're going to show you a 1109 square feet unit. I'm sure you'll love it. Let's go take a look. Now here we are at the unit. This unit is 1109 square feet. Originally a three bedroom, but they have since reconfigured it into a two bedroom. I will show you a little bit later on how it looks like. But for now, let's take a look at the kitchen first. Now this kitchen, as you can see, they have actually reconfigured this as well. Knocked down a few walls to create an open concept kitchen, right? You can see in front of me, they have created this large countertop space. So it's very convenient for you to prepare any food here, serve it out immediately. That's the advantage of having an open concept kitchen, right? Now, this space is so huge that they have actually managed to do up not only cabinetry on the inside, there's cabinetry on the outside as well. For your shoe cabinetry, you can put all your storage, small stuff there as well. And they have created a space here for your wine chiller if you have one, right? And then moving into the kitchen, all right? This kitchen has everything you need, cabinetry all done up, all right? Cooker, hood and hob. And the kitchen actually leads straight into the yard area, the wash area and the utility room. Now, the utility room is quite big, so they have used it as a storage area. So if you have anything that's big items like luggages and whatnot, you can actually store it there, right? But this kitchen actually leads into one of the main areas I want to talk about here, which is the dining area, right? Uh, they have done up a four to five seater here, but you can see that this space is really big. You can actually fit even a 10 to 12 seater here. You can actually do it this way, right? So you can host friends and families here, 10 to 12 people, no problem at all. And once you prepare your food, you can serve it straight outside to the dining area, which is really convenient if you have large family, uh, a lot of friends that usually host at home. Now this unit has one of my favorite layouts uh, in the market, which is called a dumbbell layout. Now what is a dumbbell layout? So right now what you see is a living room in the middle, there is a room to the left and there is another room to the right, right? So why is this good? It's because it helps you to maximize the space here, right? It creates maximum efficiency in the space because you minimize the amount of corridor space present inside the unit. So because of the dumbbell layout, you actually get to maximize the space in the living room as well. As you can see, wall to wall distance is pretty long, right? It allows you to get that optimal eye to TV distance. And if you have noticed, there is no balcony inside this unit. Now, if you have seen our last home tour video at Symphony Suites, you would know some of the advantages of having no balcony. It's pretty rare for a condo not to have any balcony. Now, what it does is it helps you to translate that space you will get in the balcony right into the unit itself. It goes into the rooms, it goes into the living room. So you maximize the dollar spent per square foot in your unit. Now what you get here is also a very nice landed view outside and also because it's a north-south orientation, there's no west sun into the unit. But enough about the living room, let's take a look at the common bedroom. So here we are at the common room area. Now originally the owners had a king size bed right here, but since their child moved out, they already shifted it away. So now it's more of an empty area, their study and work from home setup. Now even with a wardrobe built here, all right, and a study table built here, you really still have more than enough space to put a king size bed and walking area. Uh, but if you don't fancy a bedroom here, you want a work from home setup, this is a perfect place to do it because like I said earlier on, uh, the thing with dumbbell layouts is that the two bedrooms are separated from each other. So your work area can be separated from your rest area, right? You get some separation. Uh, and the flooring here is actually parquet flooring. So a little bit of a polish here, you'll look as good as new. And also as mentioned, check out this landed view right outside your room. So now let's take a look at the master bedroom. So what I mentioned earlier on is that the owners have converted this from a three bedroom to a two bedroom unit. What they have done is they have combined the master bedroom area with the common room beside it, creating this area that you see here. Now this was originally the master bedroom, but now it's a walk-in wardrobe. You can see full length wardrobe already built up for you with mirrors as well. And on the opposite side, you have this collapsible table uh, that serves as a vanity counter. You want to use it to study, also can. And this space, quite big. Right, so you can actually exercise here, you can do yoga here, you can dance here in front of the mirrors, uh, feel free to do so. 
Now from the walk-in wardrobe, if you move in further, you, you, through this opening, you'll lead you straight into the bedroom area. Right, so this is a king-sized bed uh, with two side tables and also a TV wall right at the opposite side. And you still have ample walking space around the bed as well. So a pretty spacious unit. Now enough about the whole unit. I know you're curious about the facility, so let's go and take a look. So Simei MRT is just 400 meters away from the project, which is just a five to seven minutes walk. Uh, this is a straight line to Raffles Place and City Hall if you need to head down to CBD area. You're also one stop to Tampanese MRT station, which serves as an interchange to the downtown line as well. Now in terms of expressways, it's really just a two minutes drive to PIE, which links to TPE and ECP. Now for shopping and dining options, East Point Mall is right at Simei MRT where you can find NTUC as well. Uh, and also one station down to Tampanese, there are various malls like Tampanese One, Tampanese Mall, Century Square, and even our Tampanese Hub, where not only will you be able to find a variety of food and shopping options, it is a sports hub filled with various sports facilities also. You also have Jewel Changi Airport, which is a short drive away and is arguably one of Singapore's best malls right now. For recreation, you can either drive down 8 minutes to Bedok Reservoir Park or a 4 minutes drive to Safra Tampanis. For facilities inside the project, there are various pools that run through the middle of the development. I think it's really beautiful if you walk along the pools right up to the main clubhouse. And the main clubhouse is where you will find a karaoke room, a billiards room, a gym and also the function room as well. Now, surrounding the properties, you'll also find kids' playground and also a barbecue pit. Uh, there are also four tennis courts in total, so you really don't have to worry about fighting with other residents for the booking of courts, right? There's more than enough for everybody. Now, if you like the unit, as usual, give us a call, drop us a DM, and we'll arrange a viewing for you immediately. This is Louis from Look Prop, and I'll see you in the next home tour. Bye!